Hi friends, it's Justine, you can call me Blondie. Today's video is gonna be a super quick Walmart beauty box unboxing. These are only $7 and they are seasonal. So this is the summer box and I'm just gonna get into it. I've done these the past few seasons um, and honestly, it's the only subscription box I currently have that I am paying for myself that like isn't sent in PR. And the only reason that I continue to get it is because it is only seven bucks. Um, and yeah, but it's fun. It's fun to get like some little surprises every month. Um, so here's a little card, Summer Glow Up. And here's a bunch of things that you could get inside, but they will occasionally have stuff in here that is not on the card. So starting off, um, we've got Liquid IV. We get Liquid IV almost every month. And every single month I say the same thing. I do not like liquid IV. I think it's so gross. I think it's chalky, but my husband loves it. He buys it regularly. So I'm just gonna give this to him. I will not drink this. Um, so let's get that out of the way. They have it almost every month. It kind of gets boring after a while. Honestly, the first time I got it, was it a little exciting because like all these influencers and mostly podcasters that I listen to always get sponsored by liquid IV and I was so excited to try it. Um, but it's gross and now I'm kind of over it. But moving on, the next thing we have is fun and is something that I will definitely be using, maybe even this week, but it is this Go Gray Purple Toning Mask. Um, embrace your gray. And I love having like a little grayish, like purpley tint to my hair. Usually when I tone my hair, I will even overtone it. So I have that kind of like gray, silvery, purpley tint. And so this is perfect for me and my hair preferences. But if you like to tone your hair and you want it platinum, um, this may not work for you. We'll see how well it works. If it does what, it's, what it says it's gonna do. Cause I do like having a little bit of gray silvery tint to my hair when I tone it. Then we have this like foil packet of extra strength pain relief cream. We almost always get at least like one foil packet, one time use sample. I'm just gonna put this like, um, in my medicine cabinet. It says uh, instant cooling with 10% menthol. So if I had to guess, I'm gonna guess it's kind of like icy hot. Um, I'm just gonna put it in my, my uh, medicine cabinet and if someone needs it, they can use it. And then we have this completely bare, don't grow there, lemongrass and green tea scent a body moisturizer and hair inhibitor, which is very interesting. I've never heard of um, a product like this. Pretty decent size for a sample. It's uh, 50 milliliters and I guess we'll try it. I'm gonna try it on my legs to see if it actually prevents hair growth. I just have a feeling that a product like this is not gonna work. Um, but you know what? We'll see. We'll don't knock it till I try it, right? And then a NYX Butter Gloss. I get NYX lip products in a lot of these boxes. This is the color Sorbet. So I'm just gonna do a little swatch. It looks very pink. Um, which I don't usually use a lot of pinks unless it's to like top, put on top of another color. And because it's a gloss, um, I usually put glosses on top of other colors anyways. So I might actually use this. If this were like a liquid lipstick, um, I probably wouldn't use it. Just cause I don't wear a lot of pink colors unless they're like nudie pinks. But there we go. That's a very pretty color. Uh, like I said, I would put it on top of something else though. Um, I wouldn't wear this on its own. I just, I, I never really wear glosses on my own. It's just a personal preference. And then we have a Cetaphil, which again, we get Cetaphil in almost, Cetaphil? 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 I'm not sure. Um, we get this in almost every box. Not this exactly, but this is a brand we get in almost every box. These Walmart boxes are getting just a little bit repetitive because it's, um, you know, we'll get things like this hair removal cream that like I've never heard of before, but a lot of the brands are repeat brands again and again. Um, so here's just a tiny little sample, only five milliliters, and it's a daily facial moisturizer with sunscreen SPF 35. So this will be nice to just throw in my purse and if I need 
some sunscreen on my face. It's good for that. So that is it for this video, this Walmart beauty box. Like I said, the only reason I'm still getting it is because it's only seven bucks. You're definitely getting your $7 worth in here, especially with that full, um, the full size lip product. But I don't know, after getting like a few seasons of these, I am getting kind of bored. There are a lot of repeat brands in them. Um, each month is kind of like less and less exciting. But I'm pretty sure this is the cheapest beauty box on the market right now. And it's still fun and because it's like seasonally and not monthly, um, I don't know. It makes me like less likely to cancel it, you know? It's only four times a year instead of every single month. But yeah, that's it for today's review. I hope y'all enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.